morning everyone welcome back to another vlog this t-shirt can only mean one thing and it is that i am bored of my hair and i'm going to dye it again however i have half of it in a plait <laughs> because i'm gonna try and do a half and half hair although my natural parting is not in the center of my head so i'm going to just do it from my natural parting and just have it like a bit maybe asymmetric let's call it that let's make it sound like it's meant to look like that yeah <laughs> so i was watching glow up season three or season two can't remember what, what it's on now the most recent one and there was a girl on it called sophie and she had like ginger hair with like a brown bit and i was like oh my god she's so cool can i be her um, doing it and then i've also been looking back at pictures and i miss my red hair so we're gonna dye this side red leave this side the gingery brown that it that it is um i have got schwarzkopf real red the one i used to use all the time so we're just gonna go for it i'm gonna put you in here use you as a mirror because the mirror's on the door on the back of here maybe i need the mirror for this maybe i'll put you somewhere else We're on. I'm gonna set my timer. Got a red ear. I think it might look good. I don't know. Um, I'm gonna go tidy the kitchen from tea last night. While this is developing, then wash it off and show you how it looks. See in sunshine if it's really bright. Hang on, I'll be there in a minute. How is it? <laughs> it's quite red. <laughs> Everyone. We've developed. <laughs> Time to wash. All right, I've dried it. And I put some makeup on. What do we think? <sighs> I quite like it. I'm gonna curl it now because everything always looks better curled, doesn't it? And then I'm going to meet my mum for a charity shop whip round um, this afternoon, and then I've got a midwife appointment in a proper afternoon at half past two. So uh, this is what outfit I'm going with. I've got like a little dress on, which has just ridden up a bit because I've been sat down and then this which was from my Disturbia haul back in December I thought I'd wear as a little cover up because it absolutely does not go over my boobs anymore <laughs> so how far away it is from going over my boobs now um but yeah I'm gonna curl my hair and then get on with my day I really like it I feel like um being an emo is back in, isn't it? Back in fashion. Being a bit seen. <laughs> I remember me and my friend Harriet. Hi, Harriet. We were talking about this the other day. Um, we decided once that we were going to be seeing kids. Not that it was just our, like, general aesthetic. It was literally like, all right, should we go be seeing kids? Yeah, okay, me too. And then we went to Claire's Accessories and bought loads of neon things. It lasted about a week. <laughs> Yeah, let's go. Okay, got a bit more seventies than I was planning. A little bit of brushing. It'll calm down. It will not stay this voluminous forever. I know my hair. Done. How does it look? I love it. <laughs> Gang, I'm off. My dad says whenever I'm in the kitchen, he can hear a buzzing noise. So if you can hear it, it's the generator outside, Dad. There's nothing I can do about it. No other appliances on. <laughs> um, maybe I'll just have to refrain from cooking on the vlogs. Got an ASOS package to take back. Got my notes for my maternity meeting appointment. And got my sunglasses for when we're walking around. We're in town. Look how summery she looks. <laughs> Running errands in your summer frock. <laughs> We've accidentally stumbled into some scones, haven't we? <laughs> With proper clotted cream. We have to sit down and get out. Yeah, and have some scones. 
I'm home now. I had my midwife appointment. Everything was fine. My blood pressure was a little bit high. Um, so I'm going back on Friday to have that looked at again. But she said she's not that worried because I don't have any other symptoms of anything bad. So it should be fine. Um, I'm not going to do anything for the rest of the day now. I'm going to relax and not think about anything that will stress me out. <laughs> I actually might go and get a shower. Very warm from walking around town. Very, very, very warm. Uh, but it's been very nice. We stopped off for scones um, in a really nice shady little cafe garden, and which I never think to go to actually. Like, it's quite popular and it's been in Hebden forever, but I never think to go there. So I always think it's an old lady tea room. Yeah, maybe I'll pick it up again another day. I'm working tomorrow, but I'm off on Friday, so I'll see you then. Hi everyone, it is now Saturday. Quite sunny actually, with uh, some clouds. Just a few clouds, probably my perfect kind of weather really. A little cloudy, but warmish. What did I do yesterday? Oh, I had the day off. I went to... Um, Went to see Becky and Beth Reader in the morning. That was really nice. Had a catch up. Had a brew catch up. It was really lovely. Becky's just, um, well, not just. She's had it finished for a while, but I haven't seen it yet. Um, finished her garden. So we set out. It was lovely. Um, and then I had to go back for my blood pressure um, test again, which was absolutely fine, uh, I think. Last time when I had it done it was a bit high, I think I just hadn't slept and it was hot and I don't like either of those things. <laughs> but everything's fine and then we came home, had a curry, we made a curry, which is just not like us. It was really nice and watched the football, <laughs> which is also not like us but it's the Euros, isn't it? Today I was supposed to be seeing Eleanor but she can't now so that's a shame. But it's probably a good thing because I really need to go through some more of my clothes that don't fit me anymore. I went, I did it like maybe the beginning of my second trimester and got rid of any clothes that didn't fit then. Or not got rid of, just put them away in a, bo in a bag where they're not like clogging up my actual space where all my nice clothes I wear every day are. So I need to do that again because there's there's even more things that don't fit me now that I'm in the third trimester and have this humongous tummy. Um, so I'm going to spend my day doing that. But it is about half eleven and I'm ravenous. So I'm going to make some lunch. I don't know what I'm going to have. But I'm going to find something to have for lunch. Okay, this is the lunch. We have gone for let's see if I've done these eggs. Oh! To perfection, look at that. I don't think this one is. That one's a bit harder, but do you know what? It's fine. I prefer it to be cooked rather than literally a, a raw egg. <laughs> it's like one o'clock and I still haven't done anything. I'm still in my pajamas. <laughs> so I am going to go and look through my drawers because it needs to be done. And then yesterday I made a cake for Father's Day, which is tomorrow. So I need to ice it, but I think I need to buy some icing sugar because I haven't got a lot. Maybe we'll go do that in a bit. <laughs> oh, I'm not motivated today. Not at all. Through the bottom and the middle drawer. And that's all the things that are mine that don't fit me anymore. All the baggy things. And then there's some skinny jeans that I'm just not wearing slash they don't fit me really. Very well, so I'm going to give them back to Becky. And... I went to pick Connor up from work too. So we are just gonna go for a little walk on the moors and then I'm gonna ice that cake. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, we were just like tucked away. <laughs> then when we get round the reservoir and we know we need the top. Then you'd be like, oh, should've gone for a longer one. Oh, no. It's the next day and I didn't ice this cake and now I'm in a rush to do it so I have to do it right now. Um just had tea and I couldn't be bothered doing it last night. And I've got to set off in like an hour. And I've just woken up so I need to ice this coffee cake. I also need to clean this kitchen and have some breakfast. <sighs> so I'm gonna do that. I'm off. See ya. Bye. Got my 
cake. And um, yeah, I think we're going to see my grandparents as well, which will be nice. Father's Day and all that. Some shoes on. This is my outfit today. I quite like it. I feel very pregnant though. <laughs> Huge. Huge mongus. We have the cake seat belted and wedged in so it doesn't slide around too much. Because there's a tiny little cake in this big tin. Big tub. Off I go. <laughs> Let me in! Who's locking doors now? Hello. Happy Hello. Father's Day. Look, it smells like coffee in here. Well, that candle. candle. Oh, I love it. Oh, Cake. Wow. That's your present. Thank you. That looks amazing. Is that? It's where's coffee. The, where's the? Oh, it's what? Oh. Where's the rest of it? No, where's the thing? Oh, IKEA. Uh -huh. Happy Father's Day. Thank you. <laughs> Do you want me to go half? Yeah. No, oh, go on. Just oh, go I'm for back. it, man. Oh, yeah. I mean, you look well, well, of it. You look well, don't you? Put yeah, you're making your cake. <laughs> and I thought you were taking it home. No, I'll take it for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> In well, you're terrible. You're terrible. At... Bernie will only want a small you're piece. You're so bad at yeah. chopping cake. One, two, three, four. <laughs> you're all right, well, are you really <laughs> do. I'm right pleased for you. <laughs> when did you make that this morning? Oh, well, I iced it this morning. I made it. Yeah. Uh, I did for yesterday. I'm going to look at a few things. Yeah. Shall we tip it over? There you go. So, yeah. Now we're up to vlog your salad. That you very happily made us. Lovely. <laughs> the coffee cake went down very well. Grandad liked it, didn't he? He didn't eat sweet. <laughs> I just wish you'd have been vlogging when he went, it's that coffee but in a cake. <laughs> Did he say that? Yeah. He didn't. He did not. Oh, oh yes, it's just like coffee but in a cake. <laughs> Alright gang, I'm home. I watch the new Disney film on Disney Plus called Luca. Looks pretty nice and easy to watch. And edit this vlog together. So I'm going to end it here. Pick it up again next weekend. Look at this cat real quick. Oh, hey baby. You're sleeping with your tongue out, haven't you? Yeah, because next weekend, me and my mum are going to Liverpool to see Tom for the day. So that'll be nice. I'll bring you with me to that. I also might try and film my um, second trimester fave vid. But yeah, that's it for this weekend. I'll see you again in the next one. Goodbye! Yee!